Hey friends, welcome back to a new video. Today we're going to be doing a cozy hobbies vlog. I have gotten a few things in the mail recently that's like cozy and fun. I got some new books and I just filmed my October TBR book haul. So if you've not watched that video, make sure to go check it out. It's my previous video that I've uploaded. So I'm really excited for today's video. Let's go ahead and get started. Hey you guys, I got the goods right here. So the first thing I got was these coloring pencils from Amazon. They're pretty good. I mean, they're not like the best, but they were pretty cheap. So I got them. Then I got this Autumn Scenes coloring book. I've already started on this one. Clearly, I have not gotten very far because got sidetracked but it's got some really cute little prompts and not prompts but like coloring pictures in it so I got that and then I also went to the public library and got another graphic novel I got the from Rainbow Rowell I got pumpkin heads it's I'm excited so let's get it going got this little cozy fireplace up on the TV he's over here gaming and then we're gonna play practical magic on Hulu and then we're not gonna read right now. We are going to color. So this is gonna be fun. Let's play practical magic and just color and we'll do the B roll. But it would not be a cozy fall vlog if I did not go to the library and get another cozy book. So I think they're getting like really tired of me because I've been going up there and renting like a book or two every single day. Slowly building them up in my house to read them and then I'm just gonna like recheck them out until I get them all read. But I wanted to go get this one graphic novel and I'm really excited to read it. The only one I could get the last time I went, which was also today, was Pumpkin Heads, which I showed you guys. Because I was supposed to go pick my brother up from school, but he texted me and said he didn't need to be picked up anymore. So I was leaving and I didn't realize that he didn't want to be picked up. So I got some annoyed here. Anyways, I'm gonna go pick it up. It's called the the only witch, I believe. Let me look real quick. My bad. It's called the okay witch. So I'm gonna go pick it up. It's a graphic novel. It's probably a super easy read. So let's go pick that up. Library is literally three minutes from my house. So let's go inside and get this book. <laughs> in the middle grade section so let's hope it's good it's a graphic novel just like the pumpkin heads one so i'm gonna read the pumpkin heads right now and i'm gonna watch practical magic still and i'll let you guys know how i like it U log is still going or the yule log whatever
so tired. It's 6 27 a.m. And I just woke up. Well, okay, so my boyfriend, he goes to work at like 6 30 and he works in landscaping. So he's always gone before I wake up. But like, I did not wake up this early for a reason. Like, I don't know why I woke up this early. I'm normally, I'm normally waking up until like noon ish. But today my body just decided to wake me up early. So we're gonna go with it. Made some coffee, I'm about to journal. I'm also gonna read on my Kindle because for my book club, we're reading Halloween Party by Agatha Christie. And I just gotta do the morning routines. Um, last night I stayed up probably till like 1 a.m. reading and I got to level, or not level, but chapter 11. And I have to read up until chapter 24 for my book club and it's already friday and the book club's tomorrow morning so we're gonna do a lot of reading today i mean i don't really have anything else to do so we're gonna put on a youtube video or something and we're gonna grind out with reading and journaling guys we have secured the goods i got a pumpkin spice latte ice and then i got a turkey bacon egg white and cheddar sandwich because i'm hungry and let's go back home we have a book club thing this morning so let's go all right you guys it's really early in the morning still i got my pumpkin spice i even changed my clothes i'm gonna share with you guys my outfit really quickly because it's like a gilmore girls meets practical magic type outfit and it's so cute all of the pieces are from Walmart, literally. They're so cute, they're so inexpensive, and they're comfortable, they're cozy. So let me try them on and let me show you guys. So clearly it's all full. The cardigan is just a really pretty knit, like burnt orange, cozy cardigan. A plain white tank top. It's not a cami, it's just like a basic tank top. I got this slip skirt. It goes below your knees and it's got a little bit of a slit. Oh, not over there, over here. And then for socks, I just have these white fuzzy socks. They're so comfortable. They're also from Walmart. <laughs> you guys, I really did not jive with that um, skirt. So I put some leggings on instead. So I have the same socks, the same leggings, or different leggings, but then the same tank top and the same cardigan. So it's more of like a cozy, comfortable, casual look. It's not super like, boho which is what i was kind of going for but it was just not very comfortable because every time i sat down the dress would like ride up and you would literally see my underwear and i just did not want somebody to freaking walk into my room and see my underwear now my dog is over here freaking trying to catch flies with her mouth story of my life kelly trying to catch a fly you trying to get flies where are they Where'd the flat go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go, sweet girl? Where'd it go? Find it. Hey guys, so I'm currently reading. I'm doing the Fox and Wood Society um, Wheat Reading Sprint, and this is with Alexandra Rosalind super excited we're currently reading halloween party by agatha christie so i'm gonna do some b-roll and yeah i'm just currently reading we have a pomodoro kitty on and yeah Hey guys, it's been a pretty relaxed day. Um, I've just been on my Fox and Wood Society live video for the, for the reading sprints for about four hours. And then we went and ran some errands. I got to about chapter 21 for the Agatha Christie book, which is the Halloween party book. And it's like so good. I'm like so ready to crack this case. 
there's only seven more chapters that I have to read, clearly. But I'm super excited. I'm ready to crack this case. I'm ready to see what's gonna go down in this book. I feel like every time somebody's mentioned twice, you need to lock them up because they're probably the murderer. So you never know. But anyways, I'm gonna do this. But now what I'm gonna do is probably play some cozy games on my Switch. Cause I haven't played on my Switch in a minute. So we're gonna do that. So I just got this one game, it's called Overcooked, and this is the special edition. I've really been liking that. And then I also play Fortnite almost every single night. And then I have Animal Crossing, which is actually a actual disc. And my Switch, it'll be right here. Then I have Among Us, I've never played that. I have Disney Dreamland Valley, Valley, what? Valley, and I've played that like a few times, not really that much. I have Stardew Valley and then Wildflowers, and these three games over here, I have not played that much, so I probably need to play them more because I've heard Stardew Valley is like a, such a cozy game. But for now, we're gonna play Overcooked.